team coverage on these attacks with News 6 reporter Johnny Fernandez, who asked Governor Rick Scott about what Floridians should do in the wake of these attacks. Today, Governor Scott stopped by Vox International to celebrate its accomplishment of moving its headquarters down here to Orlando. Not only did the governor talk about jobs, but he also paid homage to the victims of the Brussels attacks. Thank God that we have the great law enforcement, the first responders we have in our state. But if we just take a moment, do a moment of silence. Before addressing the latest economic job growth in Orlando, Governor Scott took a moment to pay tribute to the victims of this morning's terror attack. 134 more jobs for Florida families, and that's outstanding. Silence then turned to celebration as the governor announced the hundreds of jobs Vox is bringing to Orlando after moving from New York. The move is also one that he says will help accomplish his goals of bringing 1.5 million tourists to the area. We're a melting pot. I mean, we have people from all over the world coming here, and people want to be here, and they feel safe here. With the terror attacks rising, security questions all over the world, Scott doesn't hesitate to say Florida's law enforcement system is top notch. With lower crime rates and thousands of people moving to our area, Scott says both residents and law enforcement have a commitment. All of us have a responsibility also. All of us have to keep our eyes open. If we see something, we've got to call law enforcement. In Orlando, Johnny Fernandez, News 6.